Welcome to my YouTube automotive channel. In today's short video, I will show you how you can adjust and calibrate your touch screen on Ford Sync 2 vehicles. Now this should apply to pretty much any older Ford such as Ford uh, uh, Focus, Ford Edge, Ford Escape, Ford Fusion, Ford Taurus and so on. If you have a newer one with uh, Ford Sync 3, process will be a bit different. If this video was helpful, please consider supporting the channel by liking the videos, subscribing to the channel or becoming a channel member. So you will want to calibrate your uh, touch screen in case, uh, for example, you want to press a button on the touch screen and it doesn't, it's not centered. So let's say I want to turn the radio on and I have to push under the button or, or above the button to, to push the button, right? So it's not calibrated and you can fix that quite easily. Okay, now the first thing you have to do, you have to access the vehicle service mode, the hidden dealer mode actually. And to do that, you have to press the right SIG button and the CD eject button at the same time. So you want to press them and keep holding them for five seconds. And this will actually start the speaker test, which you can quit. And then you will get to the hidden menu. <clears throat> okay, here we are. So you can end this if you want. And now we are in the dealer menu. In this menu, you want to select the first option, APIM Diagnostics. And here on the right side, you have touch screen calibration, touch screen activation test. Now for the activation test, uh, that's the test pretty much to make sure that your whole screen is working. So you will have a bunch of uh, white squares. I'm not sure if you can see it on the video. And if I press any of the squares, they are gonna go first uh, blue and then white. So that's just the test to make sure your whole screen is working, right? And then the calibration test is one on the top. In this test you have to, so this X will move around the screen and you want to make sure to press exactly in the middle of that X. If you don't, you will miscalibrate it. So you wanna do this test, this calibration in case uh, your touch screen is not precise. You have to press more to the right or to the left to make sure it's uh, it's working. So press and keep holding. And now this X will move all around the screen. Okay. I think you have like five positions all around the screen. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. I hope it was helpful and educational. If it was, please like it and consider subscribing to my YouTube automotive channel. On my channel, there is lots of how-to videos, do-it-yourself videos, car reviews, product reviews, and other similar automotive topics.